Right, slight change of scene today, back at John's deadlifting, making the most of the uh, the light and the relatively good weather. It's not too cold today, so I thought I'd deadlift outside. Plus, I brought these mats along, so the surface for deadlifting is actually gonna be a little bit flatter compared to Craig's, where there is a little bit of a, an incline, so I'll see if that makes a difference with my deadlift today. Uh, I'm supposed to be working up to 225 for a single, so we'll see how that goes. I've still got a little bit of discomfort in my adductor from squats on Monday, so, I have to just wait and see how that plays out. Um, but yeah, I'm not gonna try not to think about it too much, just crack on with my warm ups and uh, hopefully work up something relatively good today. Do you always go up to the mat instead? I try to. Yeah, I do too. Yeah. Oh. Right, let's get these 50s out then. Mm. It's been a while. Yes. Do you want to do that for me? I can't be bothered. <laughs> get them, uh, like that? Yeah. yeah, but I mean, it's up to you. You're the one lifted it. But it doesn't make a difference, does it? It doesn't. Uh, that slide, I don't think that would slide. So far, so good. Joe's coming, we're all benching. Okay, Bench yeah. party! Girl, looks like whatever that power lifting association thing is. What, IPA? No. What was the it? red and black one. I don't know. How quiet is that? Alright, so 215 actually moves quite well and there's like no hype up going into the lifts or anything so um, I'm pretty confident 225 is there which is going to be the heaviest I've deadlifted while I've been training with Matt actually so um, PB of sorts I suppose it's the heaviest conventional I've done for a little while uh, so yeah, confident I'll get it done, the adductor's not hurting so yeah, let's get it done Alright then, so uh, 225 moved and I'm actually pretty happy with how quickly it moved. Um, there was no real form breakdown, so a uh, positive sign to going forward with the deadlift. Uh, just going to do some back down sets now, uh, 182 for a 4x4. And then we're going to have a little bench session together. Uh, what are you working up to on bench? 116. 116, I'm just doing 100 close grip for a few reps. Uh, but yeah, having a little bench party once I finish deadlifts. You're good, you're good. There you go. Yeah. Good. I swear I heard one. Unbelievable. Come on then. After I said nice things about your hundred. I'm oh. sorry. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> I said you had 20 reps in you. What are you doing? A hundred. What are you doing it? So you don't need a spot then? No. Okay. Oh. You're in place, John, eh? I am. I'm trying yeah. to find you a banger. Fucking DJ. <laughs> DJ oh, Johnny. I found you a banger. What a two. Screw <laughs> out! Please come for a time. Oh, three. Easy. Oh. Yeah, you got it. Nice, sir. And that was the first. Be so should be better. Yeah. He says he doesn't like dance, does he? Starts singing along. I saw Bass Hunter at Western Superman and his auto tune <laughs> broke. <laughs> but that's it, and then, then there's nothing to it. That's, I oh, saw you're one of those. It's not real music. Like, oh. Electronic music is not real music. No, it's music. not though, it's just like you press play and that's it. What is music? Who decides what music is? It's getting philosophical in it. Here we go. No, but like, okay, there's more, it's hard, hard, harder work running a band and having yeah. to play individual 
Really? I think someone like a Vici, I reckon that's much harder than a band. It's harder to make, but the hard work is done in the studio. Yeah. Yeah. And I want to see oh, the hard work on display when I buy a ticket. The live show is, yeah. It's a yeah, a live game. show. I don't want someone to just like, get a DJ set and just go press play and then I'll do a little bit of mixing. You, you want to watch them make it all in yeah. the studio? I wanna, yeah. <laughs> but I when a DJ, on, <laughs> a DJ on stage isn't just press and play. They could be mixing it live for you right there. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Which but I can't see them do serious that. Serious amount of But skill. whereas like, if I'm seeing like a band play, like I can see them playing the guitar. I can see, you can, like, I don't know. I just oh, prefer yeah, a band or something. Different, yeah. It's different, for sure. But I remember, like, when I was at uni, they had a Chase and Status uh, like DJ set, and everyone was thinking that everyone, like, from Chase and Status, they were going to come. Literally, they, they just pressed play. It was like being in a club listening yeah, to Chase and Status, that, and they made like hyped it up all week. So, like, freshers <laughs> week, there's going to be Chase and Status. <laughs> we had that same thing. Yeah, like, it's just like literally, they just pressed play, and so like, they're not even there. I thought it was going to be Chase and Status. Yeah. yeah, no, it wasn't. It was, yeah, was it, was, it not? It was, no, someone just DJ Chase and Status. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was oh, wow. really, it was really bad. <laughs> 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 Good. This is not a banger. Oh, will I get the last one? No. I'm feeling you well. Ah! Yes! Progress from last time I was here. What was that? <laughs> Yeah, it's about a month ago, isn't it? <sighs> right, that's bench done. I get to chill out in the nice reclining chair now while they finish off their session. Then just gonna do a little bit of rows, a little bit of general bodybuilding stuff, and then go home. So I'll catch you back at home. All right, Saturday today, which means one thing. I'm going to be going for another SSB PB. You're joking. Not another one? That's right, Brenda. Another one. So I'm going for 197.54 for a double today, which is very exciting. I'm going to be testing once again how the adductor feels doing some squats. Hopefully it'll be absolutely fine because when I hurt my adductor before, actually when I did SSBs, it was fine. So I'm hoping the uh, same thing repeats itself and I don't uh, hurt myself. Um, I'm also going to be working up to 140 on the uh, bench. So it's the first time I've done three plates in a, a very long time. So overall, a very exciting session today. Oh, okay, warm-ups feeling really good. Um, just about to hit my first set of 145 kilos, then going to make jumps of 7.5 kilos until I get to the top set of 197.5, hopefully. Um, I'm not going to sort of vlog and pick up my camera now until I've done it, because uh, I don't really want to distract myself uh, by picking up the camera constantly and just like chatting away. I just want to try and stay in the zone for the whole session. So uh, yeah, hopefully see you on the other side. easiest PB I've done. Okay, happy with that. Uh, another PB of 197.5 for a double. I think the plan is next week just to keep going up, so um, I think potentially 200 next week. Uh, moving on to bench now. Um, hopefully working up to 140, so it'll be the first time in a while that I've done three plates, like I said. Uh, we've got Craig with us again today hey. with his grease lightning haircut. Has he got a joke for us? Yeah. Go on then. My life. Ooh. Well, that, that took a turn, didn't it? Christ. 
keep it like Craig. So, this week has been a pretty good week of training, and it feels like it's been a while since I've said that. Um, apart from maybe Monday, when squats were feeling a little bit off, uh, but that was actually in the previous video. Um, I do need to get better at synchronising my videos, actually, because, yeah, today's SSB was done on the 6th of March, so today's the 6th of March, but this video isn't actually going to be going out until the 14th of March, so, uh, yeah, at some point I need to, like, catch up with my lifts to when I'm actually putting the videos out, but that's something for me to worry about. Uh, so, yeah, this week has been really good. 197.5 on the SSB, really happy with that, and they actually seem to be getting better each week at the moment. Um, so I'm really confident of hitting some even bigger numbers on the SSB in the next few weeks. Uh, 140, that's the first time I've done that on the bench since I think uh, the end of October, so when I went down to St Ives, or when I got back from St Ives the end of October, early November, I think was the last time I hit 140. Um, so that's really promising, bench is really coming along. Um, and that brings me on to the last point of this video. Uh, me, Craig and Sam have decided that we want to do a little healthy competition between each other. Um, and we want to race to 160. Um, it doesn't mean that we're going to like go out of our way to go off program or anything like that. We're going to do it organically and you know follow our program. Um, but we do want to see who's going to get to 160 first because we're all doing quite well on our bench at the moment. Sam obviously hasn't trained for like five months, but he actually hit a 130 single the other day and he could have done it for a triple. And he said that bench is still kind of there. And Craig is starting to build a bit of momentum with his bench as well. Um, so we're going to have a little nice healthy competition to see who can get to 160 first. And I don't know, maybe we'll try and plan it with uh, Matt, our coach, to actually have one specific day later in like three months time uh, where we can actually all go for it at the same time. But I don't know, that's something for Matt to decide whatever he says at the end of the day goes. Um, but yeah, it's a nice little competition to sort of egg each other on and just something to look forward to. Um, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much the end of this video. Just going to have a lovely vegetable curry for my post-workout nutrition. I think I'll have that with a little bit of fish for a little bit of extra protein. Uh, so yeah, and then tomorrow, chilling, not doing anything, ready to go again on Monday. So uh, yeah, gonna wrap up the video here, guys. I hope you have enjoyed it. As always, please give it a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, peace.